With India's heartbreaking defeat at the men's World Cup finals, as soon as the grieving period is over, everyone will have the same question in their minds. Will they get another shot at it? Virat Kohli has had a brilliant run in the current World Cup, being named man of the tournament. One can argue that this is peak Virat Kohli, but a lot of people are hoping for the exact opposite. Virat has been dubbed the tragic hero of Cricket World Cup 2023 and naturally people want him to exceed this. They want him to be the peak at 2027. And the entire nation saw the heartbreaking tears of Rohit Sharma from the cameras. But now the big question is whether we'll see them in the 2027 World Cup or not. Whether they'll be able to claim their cup or not. If we ask history the answer is maybe. See, there have been many people who have kept playing through their 40s. Take Nolan Clark, the Netherlands batsman is the oldest person to have ever played a World Cup at the age of 47. Or take John Trikos, who was 45 years old, who was 45 years old when he played in the Zimbabwean team against England in the 1992 World Cup. So it isn't out of the realm of possibility and can be done. But something we all need to keep in mind is that cricket is a very demanding sport. And most A-list teams such as India would ask for extremely high standards and maintaining them till the age of 40 for Rohit and 39 for Kohli will not be easy. If they want to continue playing at the same level, they will have to sacrifice. For they might be able to maintain their performances in ODI or T20 or Test, but being as good as they are right now in all of these formats will be next to impossible for their physical selves. Now, Sachin Tendulkar was 38 years old when India won the 2011 World Cup. But it has to be noted that Sachin was basically out of cricket for essentially a year, playing few games here and there to avoid any injuries and manage his workload. This takes me to one of Murli Tharan's interviews, where he stated that although one can be a great batsman in their 40s, but it will be extremely difficult to be better than the rising talent of the younger ones. Because what can one do when nerves become slower and eyesight weaker? In all likelihood, both Virat and Sharma will have to give up at least one and ideally two of the formats to maintain their peak. But that's all I think. Let me know what you think about this entire situation in the comment sections and till then keep watching Cricket Gyan for more such quick bits on cricket.